Oh, but he's speaking his lucky Chloe though. He's not uh, throwing out Nika first. Hey, yeah, but not bad. His performance, he actually like uh, went quite evenly with a couple of like international players when Tekken World Tour was a thing. So that's pretty nice. <laughs> but to be fair, right, I've played with him online before, and he he, he pulled he pulled on me, man. Right? Okay. <laughs> so, well, I can't yeah. Right. Anyway, anyway, um, let's go in. Uh, go back to Toppy. He's going against. He's going against uh Hiachi here. I think he knows. I think he knows the matchup because um he's he's. In terms of fundamentals, he's a pretty, he's a really good player. I must say that. Tekken got prime, man. Gotta show you that you're actually Tekken got prime. Oh, dude, yet another electric. I mean, then again, you're not you're not a true Mishima if you don't throw that out, right? So. I uh, do. I don't understand oh, dude, why the interrupt. The interrupt was so well timed by Heiachi. Nice step. Oh, okay. Come back to. Oh, wouldn't that crush traditionally? But like when Chloe rolls and does Heiachi's like number one hits? Okay, never mind. Uh, that didn't happen. He floats. He yeah, floats. floats yeah. Okay. Oh, nice counter here, dude. Most ah, nice, 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 nice. Yep. Dude, that kick of Chloe's is so strong. Because it hits grounded. But one thing to note is that was this: if Lucky Chloe cancels her Kelly roll, yeah, and she just stands back up. We can actually run up to her and actually launch her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Redfan has been doing that quite a few times, like running through to get a plus ring. No, but that's just Chloe things, you know. Yeah. Munga, and, but it's, but it seems to be quite hitful so far. He seems to be able to like deal, deal a lot of a uh, ton of damage in a short amount of time. And there goes the running tree, and he gets the full wall splat. This should be, yeah. and that is you know, it. That fan, man. Oh, pressuring non-stop, uh, pressuring Muchia all the way non-stop to the wall, and just like bye. <laughs> Deleted, sir. Oh boy. Uh, well, but Mushi's execution is not bad. I I've seen him like uh, out of ten times, he's he's eight or nine electrics at, at the very least. But there's no point throwing electrics if, if you don't. Yes, 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 that's true. That's true. No, but he's been whiffing so far. He hasn't yeah. gotten the right pushback. In the, uh, it was there, there are like you know there are moves that are like. That should be used at the right time. That's right. That's place. right. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, I haven't seen him throw out uh his power for two yet though. Like for, for, for pressure. Oh yeah, that's true. That's true. But then again, it's, it's up to his play style, I guess. That's true. That's true. He actually like that's you. No, but that's he actually yeah. is so limited. You have, you got to be creative with his tools and stuff. Oh, uh, but um, on a casual like for fun basis, I also play. Uh, I mean, it's just as a any if you play one Mishima, the, all all the other Mishimas is really like okay lah. So. It, he actually is quite interesting to just mess around, but I must say, like in terms of having tools, you really need the execution to really toss it out. That's true. But I think like, was this they buffed Hihachi, right? But it's just still not. The wall standing launch. Yeah, yeah. wall standing launch. Previously, you actually have to sidestep and like electric. From what I heard. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, which is ridiculous, man. Just to get a wall standing punish. Did it? No, nah, nah, man. Not anymore, man. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> let's go rap fam let's go let's go let's go yeah boy let's go rap oh, devil. fam devil jin man oh. Please. Oh, devil jin if you have the execution his tools is all over the place I must that's say. true that's true especially his wall standing yeah. too if you know how to crouch cancel into wall standing too he, he covers the meat weakness but I feel like uh, what's this the popularity of devil jin has reduced ever since season like what Ever since like season one. Ever since his up forward where it was like, yeah. heated. But for me, it's like, I still see him as like a strong character despite no, like, he, yeah. I, I, I still believe he's a really strong character. Yeah. Especially since they gave him his uh, new uh, combo ender. That's true, that's true. But I don't, know, I don't really understand why a lot of people drop him. Maybe his preference, I guess. So yeah, down forward one. Let's go. Oh, nice health feed though. Oh, he knows oh, that execution is a oh, whole time. Yeah, Man, any, anyone who has execution can definitely play Devil Jin very well. Dude, there's one thing I really don't understand about uh, Rep Fram is he's using his down 3 plus 4. I don't think that's really a good move. He's really slow. And if I'm not wrong, you can pick, oh, you that, can pick him up. They just crush each other's move. <laughs> un, un, unintentional, but that was pretty cool. Should be called Tekken Dancing. Harada-san! That can be punished, guys. That can be launch punish. The trade, the launcher trade, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, well, most well rounded, definitely. 
Oh, gets the counter hit. Nice down for HP, counter hit. That's very, oh, very fast, huh? Um, uh, Red Fam definitely closed up the round really fast. I think if he committed to it, he would have gotten that launch. Yeah. He doesn't go for it, though. Um, Mushi gets the follow up, especially from his uh, crouch dash tree. Doesn't, uh, wasn't able to get a full combo, but it's fine because he still got a large chunk of the HP. Nice follow for a tree. But he should oh, have sidestep it. We committed to flying, sir. This should get right from the wall, and this will hurt so much and commits to the mix up string. Doesn't. Oh no. Mushi is in red. What is he gonna do? And he eats. Running low. Dude, that move is actually so annoying. 